You ever find yourself just wandering around Chinaris or Livonia, staring at the sun, wishing it would stay there and it wouldn't rain, so that you wouldn't freeze and get sick, cold? Now if you look at the bottom right corner there, you see my temperature bar is in the red. Now this is dangerous, okay? That's overheating, it causes you to lose health, you don't want to do that. Ever, ever, ever. <laughs> For a short while. Also notice, I'm running around in the rain, my temperature bar is in the yellow, and my health is going up. Just don't let it get in the red, okay? Maybe you want to swim over to Prison Island. Keep your temperature bar in the white. Unfavorable Gamer here with another DayZ tutorial teaching you how to stay warm during the rain in DayZ. So here's how this all goes down, guys. First thing you want to do if you encounter some wolves, find a deer, kill a bear, kill some chickens. Whatever you have to do to get meat, get it. Um, you're going to want about six pieces of meat to completely insulate you. And we call this the meat blanket, the meat wrap, meat soup, whatever you want. Whatever you want to call it, whatever suits your fancy. Call yourself a little hot dog, I don't know. Just wrap yourself with some meat. Um, now this was a good kill. He's got a pretty big rack on him. You want to chop that guy up, as you do with any animal, all right? And again, grab about six pieces of meat. Now, just putting the meat on your body raw is not going to do a damn thing. So start yourself a nice little fire, cook that shit up, and understand that each piece of meat has a different, different temperature rating. Now, you're like, what do you mean temperature rating? I didn't know meat had temperature. It holds temperature after you cook it. Here, check, take a look here, this is what I mean. See this piece? 75 degrees Celsius. Piece of fat, 75 degrees Celsius. Oops, same piece. This piece, 100 degrees Celsius. So, they have different temperatures. And what you want to do is put three pieces in your jacket, three pieces in your pants. Now, two pieces each will suffice. I go with three just to be completely insulated when I'm swimming over to Prison Island, if that's what you want to do. Um, do this. And you guys can run around in the rain all day long. It saves, saves you so much time and hassle because you know when you're wet, your food goes down fast. And you'll have food to eat. Anyhow, thanks for tuning in, guys. I love you. Catch you on the next one. Peace.